So I just started school this week. And I'd like to share with you my awkward stories from day two of school. I'm going to break this video down into different videos of different days. Uh, there's too many stories in day two to tell in one video. So for this video, I'm doing day two, part one, math class. So I'm sitting in math class, just minding my own business, and people are coming in and sitting down. You know, it's second day of school. We've never seen these people before. Teacher's not in there yet, and the class is full. It's like 30, 40 people. It's completely full, and nobody is saying a word. It's dead quiet. So I think to myself, man, this is awkward. And everybody looks at me. And it's at that moment, I realize I said it out loud and not in my head. Then this girl uh, to, the, to the right of me leans over and starts talking to me. And when she starts talking to me, she looks above my head when she's talking to me. You know, she's like, we're talking. And just, I'm like, oh, okay, well... My first thought is, oh, she has a lazy ass. So I don't need to say anything. It'd be even more awkward. So the next time she turns around and is talking to me, I realize she doesn't have a lazy eye. And she's just talking. And I'm like, oh, what is this girl doing? And I say, so what are you looking at? And she goes, that a clock on the wall. You mean the one that doesn't work? There's no clock. Just pretend there's a clock here. Pretend that's not working. And so the one that's not working, she goes, yeah, it, it bothers me. And I go, you're weird. She goes, you're insulting. I go, no, 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 no. I'm awkward. That's just a byproduct. So that's that conversation. The teacher's call and roll, and he gets to me, and he says, Brandon. And I say, actually, I, I prefer to go by Garrett. You know, I'm pretty perfectly reasonable. I go by my middle name. You may not, but, you know, teach their own, whatever. And she leans over and goes, what kind of name is Garrett? And I go, what kind of name is Aubrey? Because her name was Aubrey. I forgot to fill you in on that earlier. Her name was Aubrey, or is Aubrey. Uh, every now and then she'll say something to me. We'll talk back and forth a little bit. Class is over. We're done. So she gets up and starts walking out, and I get up and walk out. I'm like, all right, though, that was an awkward awkward day. She's waiting outside of class for me. Yeah. Waiting right outside of class. So I turn to the left and start walking. So she turns to the left and she starts walking with me. We're, we're walking together. And then I'm like, oh, I don't want to walk with this girl. So I turn right. I'm walking the opposite way of the hallway. She turns right. He goes, where are you going? I go, to, to the bus stop. So I'm just going to follow you. Right. So I say, uh, are you are you new here? She goes, yeah, I'm a freshman. And she found me. So we're walking along. She's talking to me, and I'm trying to you know go and I'm walking to the bus stop. And I see a bus, and I go, well, I, this is my bus. I got to go. And she's like, All right, well, I'll see you Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, I'll see you Tuesday. And I get on the bus. And I sit down next to this guy on the bus, and we're talking. And the bus pulls off, and it's going. And I turn to the guy and say, I'm on the wrong bus. This girl messed me up, put me on the wrong bus. So now I need to get to this side of campus, but I'm going to this side of campus. So this is where my story will pick back up in the next video. So be sure to go watch that. Gosh, I'm so awkward. <laughs>